Okay, got two pairs of Clark's Desert Boots here. Uh, this is the suede which I have in my other video putting on some coconut oil. This is a new um, beeswax. So let's go ahead and open it up. Let's take out one of the shoes. And this is how it looks when you just first take it out. It's a little scuffed in the front right there. But again, uh, part of the appeal of this beeswax is that uh, eventually as you wear it, it's going to pick up a lot of these different scratches and nicks and really just um, get a patina of its own. So you'll notice that this is a dark leather and it's smooth. Let's compare it to the suede. Okay, so here is the suede desert boot that I um, put coconut oil on. So it's, you know, a little bit waterproof because that does provide a shield to it. You'll notice it's a little bit darker and it has some spots, uh, whereas before it was just completely bright. So again, this one also, as you start to wear it, it'll start picking up um, just some of the characteristics and really make it stand out so that it looks different. So looking at the two boots right here, this one looks a lot dressier just because it is that smooth leather and the leather goes down to this um, part of the sole, whereas this one uh, looks a little more, you know, rugged, kind of outback just because of the suede that you have on it. Both are gum sole. The Bush Acre from Clark's does not have the gum sole, so keep that in mind. But both of these do have gum soles. Gum soles are um, pretty comfortable and just last a really long time. But even though these two boots are the exact same style, because of the material, you can just tell the difference in you know how they look. All right, so there you have it. You have the Clark's Desert Boot in Maple Suede and the Clark's Desert Boot in Beeswax.